I'm John Mizell, and this Pick of the Week is special because my executive producer, Frank, can relate to it. It's about a girl. Here's animation runner, Kuromi. Okay, Frank, I understand you're not a girl, you're not a girl, but but it's about a girl who is an executive producer. In fact, she's the head of the studio. Okay, you feel better, Frank? You feel good? Okay, good, thank you, Frank. All right, it's about a girl named Kuromi, fresh out of animation school, and her dream job is to work with a studio called Petite Studios. So she got hired, but guess what? She didn't expect to be the entire head of the whole studio, due to the fact that the former head of the studio got a health problem and had to go to the hospital. Now. Oh, 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 oh. I'm almost out of time, I go. It's not good at all. Help me. Good luck, Karome! Good luck! Wait a good luck! The best part about this movie is that this girl has to manage all these slackers. Um, Frank, can you relate to that? Um, I will try to work harder next time, Frank. Sorry. Time journeys. A lot of people that Kuromi works with have these colorful personalities, but one of the characters that really sticks out to me is Haraguchi. The characters, they're not designed so good. She's, she's that woman that lacks a lot of confidence, and she always complains that she always has the hardest characters to draw. Now, Kuromi, which is kind of funny, that once she encourages the, this woman that she is great at her talent, then she becomes all ballistic. I mean, she basically flips out with love. Uh, you know I always felt that way myself. And you got this lady who smokes all the time. She looks like Charlie Theron, who does not want to be there at all. Shihamatsu, that's a pencil you're smoking. <laughs> oh, and by the way, the, the piece that they're working on is called Time Journeys. Time Journey! They're gonna play that again. Time Journeys. Time Journeys. Yeah. Anyways, they do a lot of parodies of other anime films out there. Basically, the anime industry in general. There's a scene where it actually cuts back and forth between really good quality anime and really bad anime. Really good quality again and bad quality. Good quality, bad quality. I'm sure Frank will show you the clips. Or maybe not, or maybe he did, I don't know. They all try to meet their deadline and it's a big time crunch for them, especially when they're all slackers. But will she ever get the whole thing done in time? Don't you know there's a deadline? Deadline? My name is John Mizell and you should definitely check out my pick of the week. And I'm on deadline, so I got some other pick of the weeks to watch. It's not good enough, you have 